What's up, everybody? It's John with John Sports Arts Collectibles coming at you with a brand new video. How's everyone doing out there today in the TV universe? I'm sliding in the bell um, because I bought, I picked up uh, three of these pristine 20 hockey cards plus one jersey or autograph card included. There's three of them here. I opened these up about two months ago, maybe a little bit longer than that. I, I had a good time with this product. It was fun. We got a couple Hall of Famers um, out of the relics, you know, a couple okay ones, and then one was like not so good. But um, I figured I'd try them again. They're they're a low cost entry, point five bucks a piece. Um, I, I love opening products like this, as you well know if you watch our watch our channel for the last five almost six years. I love opening up mystery products. Um, they're fun for me, uh, especially pack pack products, the Fairfield products. MJ Holdings is okay too, um, and I love older ones too. But I love I really like these Prestine. Release to they're not you know they're not the they don't always produce the best uh, hits and the cards can sometimes be junky but for me they're fun I, I still like them so let's open up this first one Matt's Zuccarello um, here with the Minnesota Wild upper deck card and on the back you've got Christopher T Tanev for the uh, Calgary Flames upper deck as well and um, let's see what we get out of here. It's always a fun product, in my opinion. Okay, and again, you're not going to get any, like, you know, $1,000 card out of this. Although, I did pull out a few good cards. It looks like we have a relic um, out of the baseball product in the past. And the hockey one produced some okay ones, too. Uh, my first time opening up this version of this product was, like I said, a few months ago. Um, the video is kind of, kind of a good one. There's Matt Zuccarello. Um, it's an ice, upper deck ice, by the way. I think it's just a base. Calvin DeHaan. You have some score action happening, a few of them. Um, Kelly Johansson and... Let's see, is this in French too or just in English? Hold on a second. It is only, this is the English version of this. Of this. So we were pulling some Canadian cards. I mean, it is a Canadian company. Um... I'm pulling some uh, some score uh, Canadian Canadian versions of, of of this release in the last one, and um, and that was Bob Joyce, Clint Malarchuk, pretty good goalie, pretty good goalie here with the Sabers. Um, I don't know if that's a rookie or not. Probably a second year. So. Um, Pretty interesting stuff right there. Next one is Grant Ledyard. It's a pro set. Doug Wilson. Tops. There were the San Jose Sharks. Hall of Famer Doug Wilson. Longtime Chicago Blackhawk. Frederick Olson. Winnipeg Jets. The J E T S Jets, Jets, Jets. I know that's for the New York Jets, but I like saying it now for these guys. That looks like it'll be a second year card. You got another. Um, pro set, it's Phil Bork, not Ray Bork, Phil Bork, still was one of the Pittsburgh Penguin announcers. Gary Galley, I want to say he was on the Kings, too. Watch, there he is, Los Angeles, and then Washington, and then there were the Bruins. Another Gary Galley, the Gary Galley collection is in here. There were the Flyers, more of these scores. Oh, I just gave away whatever it was as a Bowman. Okay, let's go with this stuff here. I didn't see what that was. Maybe you guys did. Because we're Tanvi. Uh, Michael Sergachev. Some upper deck, more modern upper deck. And these are from 21, 22, Series 1. So more recent upper deck cards. Um, okay, continuing Claude Lemieux. I don't know if Claude's in the Hall of Famer. I imagine he is. I'm not up to speed on all the Hall of Famers in the, in the NHL Hall of Famer. He was really good, Claude Lemieux. I imagine he is. There's a pro set card for him. Uh, been in the league for a little while with the Canadians and then uh, on to the Devils. It's probably second year Devils card. Pierre Turgeon, another great player. I think he's probably in the Hall of Fame too. Parkhurst. Here were the Islanders. Pat LaFontaine. Good player right here. I'm not sure if he's in the Hall or not, but he was pretty damn good. Uh, here were the Islanders and Tony Granado. Ends up the little stack here. Well, not ends up, but ends up what we're holding. There were the Kings, and that is from 90, 91 tops. Okay, continuing here. So we're going to flip that around. I'm trying not to give that away. Got Scott Ar Arnell, or Arneal. 
of savers at score. And then um, we end with Keith Brown. And then here is also Greg Pazlowski, second year card, I think, with the uh, Winnipeg Jets. Let's see who this is. Fabric of the game, of the future, sorry. Game worn jersey. So a rookie of somebody, but it's a Bowman. So I didn't know they had Bowman relics for uh, hockey. Uh, and there it is. Who is this? Alexander Zvitov, Tampa Bay Lightning. Um, I don't know who that is. I don't recognize the name. Young Stars, 2002-2003 Bowman Hockey. Okay. Center Iceman for the Tampa Bay Lightning. I say Devil Rays. I hope it didn't. Tampa Bay Lightning. Okay, so Fabric of the Future, kind of like, I don't know if that's a rookie or not. And then here's Greg Puslowski. So there's, that was, you know, not too bad of a pack. Okay, cards. Um, let's continue here, folks. Second one. Second one. Let's see. We got Mike uh, Suzuki. Suzuki. Starts us out. Upper deck from 21-22, Series 1. Next one, Artifacts. Pius Sutter, Suter. Pius Suter, is it Pius or Pius? I'm not sure. Um, Ronnie Francis, they were the Whalers before he went over the Penguins. That is not a second-year card. These scorecards all have like one season on there. I've been saying they're second-year cards they are not. <laughs> so I apologize for that. Like Greg, Greg Puzlowski, no. Look how many games he's played, but it, it's deceiving. I thought they only have one year of stats on there, the year um, prior to them these coming out. So 89, 90 stats. So I apologize just to saying some of those are like second-year cards because they're not. Okay, Ronnie Francis. Next one, Ron Suter. From the Suter Brothers. Bob Rouse. Okay, Peter Klima. Decent player. I don't think he's in the hall or, not, or anything like that. A pretty decent player. Some goal scoring ability. It's a upper deck collector's choice. Wayne Presley, pro set. Tim Waters. So I see Paul Coffey in here. That's cool. Uh, Tim Waters is upper deck from 91-82. Um, Eric Johansson. That is a prospect card for upper deck. So, Canadian Hockey League. That's kind of cool. So, I'll put, this, I'll put that one aside. I, I don't recognize that name. Kay Whitmore, top prospect card for the Hartford Whalers. Brass Bonanza. K. Whitmore, goaltender there for the Whalers. Okay. Rob Pearson, 90. Was it 91 82 upper deck? 92 93. Sorry. It's hard to read that little small print there. Steve Yeiserman, Hall of Famer. It's a cool one. Been in the league a few years at that point. Paul Coffey, in the Hall of Famer right there. I believe. With the Penguins. And Bernie Nichols. Nice gave away whatever that was as an oiler. Uh, I didn't see it. Sorry, guys. Uh, Chris Dahlquist, Stadium Club. They were the North Stars from Pittsburgh Penn. Claude Lemieux again. Mike Hartman, Tops, Jeff Smith. Another score action card there. Oliver Ekman Larson for the when, uh, when I pick, Vancouver Canucks. Sorry. And then Kevin Fiala. 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 Sorry, I'm saying that wrong. For the Minnesota Wild. Okay, let's see who's behind old Bernie Nichols right there. He was another decent player. I don't think he's in the Hall of Fame. Let's see. We flip this around. Okay, let's see what we got. Which way is this going? I don't know which way. It's going this way. Okay, here we go. Fleer. Ultra. It's a relic. Who is that? From the Edmonton Oilers. Sam Gagner, probably saying that wrong. It's not Gagne. Ultra Uniformity, Edmonton Oilers. I do not recognize the name at all. <laughs> um, okay. 
So it's an official, uh, it was used to, it was a, you know, official game used to, um, uh, relic from what, 2009, 10 Fleer Ultra. So there you go. Uh, I'll look him up. I'm not sure who he is. I don't recognize that name. There's Bernie Nichols there with the Rangers at that point. Okay. Long time Los Angeles King, I think. And, uh, last one. Got Charlie Coyle. It's the face card in this one. Next up, we have another uh, Pace Suter artifacts. Brett Hall, record breaker card, or record setters card. Brett Hall, there were the Blues. I think he's in the Hall. Essa Tikkanen, Edmonton Oilers. Uh, Brian Bellows, good player right there. I'm not sure if he's in the Hall or not, but really good player for the Minnesota North Stars. Pat for Beak on the Hartford Whalers uh, card. Awesome. Parkhurst. You've got uh, Glenn Anderson. Not sure if he's in, but he should be. He was really good. Played for a long time. Craig Simpson, a decent player there for the Oilers. Uh, Chris Drury. Did you know? What is this? Beehive Hockey. Well, that's pretty cool. It's got a, a mark down here in the corner. But uh, I've never seen this release before. Who put this out? This is an upper deck. No, yeah, an upper deck release. Beehive Hockey. That's pretty sweet. Look, Trevor Kidd. I think that's a rookie. Um, but Trevor Kidd, decent goaltender. I love, look at that. He's got that, that total 90s look good with his glasses and everything else. That is a 90s look right there. Trevor Kidd, uh, goaltender there with the Calgary Flames. Another Paul Coffey, another double. Uh, some prospects in here. Let's see what we got. We've got, um, three of them in a row. Cam Russell, Blackhawks, Pierre, uh, Lappin, and then you've got, Shane Stevenson is, is covering up the what I'm assuming is another relic. And another prospect, filled with prospects this pack. Sergey uh, Charin. Uh, top prospect for the Jets. You got uh, Bob uh, Asenza. A goaltender there for the Jets at that point. There's Parkhurst. You got Russ Cortnell, the pro set. Somebody behind him doing stretches. I can't tell who that is. Sergey Fedorov. I believe he's in the Hall of Fame. Definitely. I think he is. It's incredible. Uh, nice Fedorov right there. And two upper decks. You've got Jordan Eberle and Marcus Johansson. So there you go, though. The Kraken and the Islanders. And then let's get our last card here. Let's see what this relic is. My old Shane Stevenson. Let's see. Hot Prospects. Who is this going to be? Hot Materials. Another oiler. And it is Bob, Rob Schrempf. <laughs> and that looks like a Band-Aid. No lie. Look at that. It looks like a Band-Aid. It's not. It's a piece of fabric. But uh, I don't know who Rob is. I don't recognize these oilers. This They must have ruled that. I'm feeling this is before Connor McDavid. It is. And uh, this is from 2007, 8. Or, yeah. The seven eight, I'm guessing, uh, this release, and um, I think they were pretty bad. If I can remember, if I'm remembering co correctly, right? I don't think they were very good. The Oilers, so um, I don't know about these relics. I will look them up, but I don't think there's anybody major in here. Here they are: two Oilers, and we'll put them in the bookends. And then we got a Tampa Bay Lightning, Alexander uh, Svitov. Probably saying that wrong, and that's it, guys. Got some, got some okay rookies. There's a whole bunch of this pile here. Trevor Kidd's one of the more notable ones in here. Got this uh, Chris Drury Beehive card. Never seen that before. Um, and some other rookies in here. But this is it. This is fun. I mean, I, I like this kind of product. It's fun for me. It's a low price point, and you do get some relics. These are a lot up in the store. And some people want these relics. You know, they, they collect these uh, these items for sets they're building, or maybe they like the player. I mean, one of the relics we pulled, we sold to somebody over in Germany. It was an international relic of one of the goaltenders who didn't have a major career, but someone picked it up and bought it and bought it in the international sale and went out to them. And, you know, so there are people out there who want these, uh, want these items. Oh, let me ring the bell just once for the, uh, all the relics since I haven't done it in a while. Um, but there you go, guys. I'll have more videos in the way soon. Uh, some really interesting ones. So look out for those. 
And um, yeah, that's all I got for you guys. I greatly appreciate you stopping by. Remember to like, subscribe, comment down below, share this video with your friends, family, and loved ones. Please go check out our eBay store, why don't you? The link's down below in the description. We've got some cool items for sale over there. I think maybe there'll be something there that you might be interested in. The link is down below in the description. Go check out our eBay store. That's all I got for you guys today. Thanks again for stopping by. This is John Jones, Sponsors of Collectibles, signing off, and hey, I'll see y'all soon.